What's up guys, today I'm going to show you several awesome Lincoln scents representing pocket change from 1980s. Starting with this fascinating 1980s Lincoln scent, well, at first glance it seems like a damaged coin, but such appearance is a result of mint error. According to NGC, the company which created it in Mint State 64 Red and Brown, this Lincoln scent was struck on a scene and defective planchette. Hard strike exposed the underlying zinc in many areas, these spots resembling oil stains. The pleasure of this coin was so thin that it weighs even less than one gram. The 1980s Lincoln scent struck on a scene defective planchet is a rare error coin. The coin shows a mix of its original red luster and brown toning, indicating some exposure but remaining in high state preservation. Error coins like these are highly coveted by collectors due to their rarity and unusual circumstances of their creation. The combination of its mint state grade and dramatic error makes it a particularly valuable and intriguing piece. It was sold for $168 at Stax Bowers auction. The 1984 Lincoln Sand struck on an unplated zinc planchet with a verse tie break is a captivating error coin. Typically, Lincoln sands are composed of a zinc core with copper plating, but this specimen was struck without a copper layer, revealing the zinc core. This gives the coin a silver appearance, quite different from unusual copper hue. Adding to its intrigue are obverse die breaks, which are raised irregular lines of cracks on the coin's surface caused by damaged die. These die breaks make the coin even more unique and desirable among collectors. Graded MS63 by NGC, it maintains a high level of detail and sharpness despite the errors. The combination of unplated planchet and die bricks makes his 1984 Lincoln scent a true numismatic curiosity, offering a glimpse into minting processes, complexities, and fascinating errors that can occur. It was sold for $384 at Stax Bowers auction. The 1977D Lincoln Sand with double struck obverse die cap error is an extraordinary coin. This type of error occurs when the coin gets struck multiple times while still adhered to the die, resulting in a distinct cap like appearance. The appearance strike, the double strike, amplifies this effect, creating dramatic and eye catching distortions on the obverse. Graded MS63 Red and Brown by PCGS, the coin exhibits a mix of original red luster and brown toning, indicating minimal wear and retaining significant detail. The double strike sometimes causes overlapping images of Lincoln's portrait, making it a fascinating piece for collectors who appreciate minting anomalies. The reverse of coin may show weaker strike or be concave due to the die cap error. Adding another layer of intrigue, this unique error coin is a remarkable example of the unexpected and captivating results of minting mishaps, making it highly sought after by numismatists. This rare error scent was sold for $1260, a superb gem 1986 Lincoln scent in incredible MS69 red condition. Nearly 4.5 billion Lincoln memorial cents made it out of the Philadelphia Mint in 1986. Among them, this top graded MS69 red representative. Each side is pristine and fully struck with mint copper red color. The 1986 Lincoln cent graded MS69 red is an exemplary specimen representing one of the highest possible grades for coin of this type. MS69 indicates that the coin is in nearly perfect condition with only the slightest imperfections visible under magnification. The red designation means that the coin retains at least 95% of its original mint luster, a characteristic highly prized by collectors. In this great 1986 Lincoln scent showcases sharp details in Lincoln's portrait and the reverse design of Lincoln Memorial. This specimen was sold for staggering $5,760 at Heritage Auctions. This is 1982D small scent struck on a bronze planchet, very rare transitional alloy error, graded as AU58 by NGC due to the rising cost of copper. Since transition from bronze to copper plated zinc during 1982, the quality of strikes declined and modifications were made to the obverse legends, including the date, to allow faster press production of the zinc scents. At Denver, the small date subtype was introduced 
After the remaining bronze planchets were coined, any surviving 1982D small date bronze scents are transitional alloy errors, cousins to the famous 1943 bronze scents. This small scent is sharply struck and minimally and minimally abraded with medium to deep walnut brown toning. It was sold for $10,800 at heritage auctions. Another wonderful error coin, the undated Lincoln scent was memorial reverse made from copper-plated zinc and featuring an obverse die break. It is a unique error coin. Typically Lincoln scents from 1982 onwards are composed on zinc core with a thin copper plating. The absence of date adds to the coin's intrigue due to severity of the die break. An obverse die break is raised irregular line or area of the coin's surface caused by damaged die hiding its date, which can create dramatic visual effects and makes the coin highly collectible. Graded MS63 red and brown by NGC, the coin maintains a good level of detail and sharpness with a mix of red luster and brown toning. This error coin with its undated feature and obverse die break offers a fascinating glimpse into the imperfections that can occur during the minting process, making it a desirable piece for collectors. It was sold for $105 at Stax Powers auction. The 1987 Lincoln Sand graded MS69 Red by PCGS is an exceptional example of nearly perfect coin. With a mean state 69 grade, this coin is just one point shy of highest possible grade MS70, indicating it has only the tiniest imperfections that are nearly invisible to the naked eye. The red designation signifies that the coin retains the at least 95% of its original red mint luster, making it especially desirable among collectors. Such high-grade coins are rare and they must have been carefully preserved since their minting. This level of preservation combined with brilliant red color makes the 1987 Lincoln Sand MS69 Red a prized addition to any numismatic collection. It was sold for $7,593.75 at Great Collections Auction. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed learning about these fascinating error coins, please like, comment, and subscribe for more numismatic content. Stay tuned for our next video.